What's going on guys, I'm back to another video, in this one I'm going to be showing you how to make a backyard barbecue, because I couldn't think of much. Okay, my mic is working. And also, again, sorry. Hang on one second. And, um, yeah, sorry that, again, I've been busy, because we've been to Spirit like three times. We've gotten four different live wires and only two of them have worked. And it seems that the two that have not worked have been tampered with because the try me buttons were not there. It's weird. So yeah, here it is again. I've just been busy. And this is actually the house I'm using. It's a perfect example because it already has this glass wall here. And, um, yeah. So, I don't actually have a space, but I can really quickly do it. It's pretty much the length of the house. And then it's 12 blocks backwards, and also two on either side. Now, I do have that row of grass there, just kind of, I don't know why, but it's there. So, you're going to want to get out white stained glass panes, brown carpet, either fence or glass. I'm going to use, like, gray stained glass paint for the fence area. Stone. Oakwood stairs, black concrete, and dark oak trap doors. Oh yeah, if you also want to, you can get out campfires. This is just kind of like a s'mores making area if you want that. Don't really need it, but whatever. So coming to this area here, as you can see, it is already... um. So I'm actually going to start on this side. So you're going to want to count from the, the second block in or towards the front, I guess, which is this one. And you're going to want to go right with two light gray stain or two fence material. I'm using the wrong um, glass. Then it's going to want to go backwards by 12. And then it's going to want to go right until it overhangs the other side of the house by two. And then it's going to want to go forwards and then connect to the wall. Now you can count this. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It should be eleven. So I did my math wrong. So it does want to be another row. So yeah. This time of year is busiest for me with um, decorating, but you know, hopefully, obviously, in January I should have everything back to normal. Christmas is gonna be hard with having to um, have the inflatables dry unless it doesn't rain, which is like a zero point, like a point one percent chance. But anyways, that's great. You're gonna want to leave one row on every single side, just like this. And then you're gonna want, so you're gonna have one wall of glass, on, or you don't need it. And you're just gonna want to break this entire inside shape here and replace it with stone. I don't know who's at the door, but that's their problem. Or probably no one. It's probably a dog walking by, because that's Bailey for you. Now I do have this lime concrete, I'm gonna actually get rid of that real quick. Just to kinda give it a perfect look. My bad, I'm actually gonna do that. I don't know why I have that um, weird thing where I have to be, everything has to be perfect. Day and week. Always good week. Always nice having a weekend. Eddie also, the experimental Eddie video already has nine views, so that is amazing. Servers with the fog has six. Or no, servers with the fog might have three. 
One is three and one is six. Okay, when I showed you Cerberus with the fog, that is six and the review is three. Cerberus is what, 2014? Correct me on that, it's either 15 or 14. And I don't remember what, whoever knows, tell me in the comments, because I don't know. I missed school to get that, call me spoiled, but I did. And also, it was mainly for Experimental Eddie, but you can't lose this $50 for a three-headed dog, which is, I think, a Greek, myth Greek mythology thing. Once you've done that, you can count out to the fourth stone block here on the right side, and you're going to place a black concrete with a dark oak trap door on its left and right. Place a dark oak trap door that is flipped up. Now, like I'd say, probably two blocks away, place an oak stair. Actually, let's do three blocks away. No, two. Because we're shifting this. What we're doing is we are... We're just shifting this whole thing towards us a well. And then you're going to want to place a dark oak trap door in front of it. And place kind of four, just like that. So if you flip them up, they should all be like that. I got rid of the wrong thing. Oops. So yeah, they should all be flipped up like that. Place a campfire in the center and place an oak stair on each side, just like that. And there you have a little campfire area. Now, like, you can, I guess, come out, like, three blocks and place an oak stair. Leave a one block gap and place another one. Now leaving a one block gap going that way, kind of like a two block gap, sort of. So move diagonally and then go right, I guess, another. Then do another... And then on the opposite side, you can do the same thing there. And over here, okay, you should have a three block gap. Yeah, that's correct, and have one there and there. Again, that was really poor description, but you should see. So these are five blocks apart, and these are three. And you want to do that same setup kind of like right around here. So you should have just, where these two stairs are, you should have a pair facing the opposite direction two blocks away from it, and then just do the same configuration of thingamabobs. Shut up, uh, Mr. Squidward. Was it Mr. Squidward? Who was it? Yep, it definitely was him. He was basking, and now he's not basking, so there's my biggest hint. Once you've done that, take out your white stained glass panes, and inwards diagonally from every single, um, stair. So, like, the triangular point of the stairs kind of like that you're gonna want to place a white stained glass pane and then you can just connect them together with a row of three going down the center place a brown carpet on top of every single white stained glass pane and oh yeah you need a string as well you're gonna wanna place string in these corners, just like that. Oops, don't place it on top of your brown carpet cause that ain't doing much. And then place brown carpets on top of your string. Now this table design I do personally like. It's a very modern design. And again, add anything else you'd like, or if I, I don't know if I said that. But again, you have space here, here. Wow, well, I keep saying again, because it's not again. So you have all the space, really, to do whatever you want. But thank you guys for watching this video, and hope you guys did enjoy this video as I say this into the playlist as usual. I'm going to save this into the house playlist. Because why not? Well, only the house tutorials. Have a fantastic rest of your day or night, and I will see you in the next one. Peace!